Hey everyone, it's Nate with Outside Cleaners here on Cape Cod, Massachusetts, where today I'm in Yarmouth. I'm gonna be cleaning this asphalt roof. Uh, these are what's called 30 year shingles. You can tell from the design of the shingles. So that's how long they're supposed to last. This roof is only about 12 years old and you can see how afflicted it's become with organic growth. So those dark streaks there, that's an algae. And if we look closer, you can see little flecks of moss and lichen that are forming. And that's super common, especially right on the uh, side under a tree or on the north side of a roof. Um, there's lots of ways to clean an asphalt roof. Uh, they're not all comparable in terms of their pros and cons. Uh, some are quick, some are slow, some are very, very damaging to the roof shingles, some are not. I'm going to be cleaning this roof in direct accordance with the roof shingle manufacturer's instructions, which is to say I'm going to be putting on a strong solution of chlorine bleach. That's going to basically instantly remove the dark streaks of algae. It's also going to kill the moss and lichen, causing it to slowly fall off in the coming weeks with time and weather. Um, as I said, there's other ways to clean an asphalt roof. Some you just treat it and walk away and then over the course of months, the roof cleans up. Uh, some use much weaker chemicals than chlorine. Uh, there's local services that will offer to gently power wash your roof. Uh, that's definitely not recommended by the roof shingle manufacturers as it absolutely will shorten the lifespan of the roof. I've got more info on that on these other videos here that I'll link to. So once again, this is an asphalt roof. I'm gonna be cleaning this in exact accordance with the shingle manufacturer's recommendations. This is an instant process, quote unquote instant. So when I'm done here in a couple hours, this roof should be dramatically cleaner. Uh, there'll be no question that the roof has been cleaned. Now they do make uh, synthetic fragrances that a lot of roof cleaners add to their chlorine solution so that it smells like lemons or flowers or whatnot. I don't like that because I've seen that attract bees and then you look down and in your puddle of discharge there's a bunch of dead bees. I think that's a bad idea. So I'm using chlorine, it's going to smell like chlorine. And then in a little while that smell is going to fade away. All right, well, here's the process. Enjoy the view.
shade now, but you get the idea.